Hey, so quick update. What's up, everybody? Um, on my headlight buckets, I've been restoring. I fiberglassed the bottom of these. Fiberglass the bottom of that. I made that part right there. Sealed that part up. I had to use the fiberglass like two or three times. I was trying to do this part. It kept falling off. It wouldn't. Uh, it wouldn't cure right. Sanded it down to 150. I used 150 grit sandpaper. Still uh, kept falling off and sliding off. Wasn't sticking to the plastic. I used uh, fiberglass filler and the fiberglass filler hardener. Still kept doing it. Hold on. And it still kept uh, the when I used the fiberglass filler, I could literally just do like this and it would come off. I did. I did. Uh, I used the fiberglass filler and um, Bondo hardener. Mixed it up and it was kind of like a reddish green. So what I did to test it out, I um, did like I built I built this section right here pretty much. I put like a layer right here, let that dry, and then I kind of uh, took some cardboard and I pressed it against the back side and I used my uh, spread thing, a little yellow thing, and I layered it like that. And it was really thick, so I used a Dremel that I bought from Walmart a long a long time ago and just uh, shaped it like that with the Dremel and sanded it down quicker and then I used it on this part right here and also on this part and I uh, did 150 grit then I used 220 sandpaper and uh, made this part this smart this part is smooth right here I need to finish touching it up you can see the uh, thickness difference so I might either leave it like that and just spray paint it black over it because these are going to pretty much bolt up to the uh, be bolting onto the car I lost my passenger side driver side uh, yeah my driver side little marker thing I think it's in the trunk of the Impala or it's in the shed it's somewhere it's it's running around here somewhere so I'll find that later on when I go to install these how I did my holes how I'm gonna drill my holes where's it at I traced this out this works for both sides That work. This is for the passenger side. I flip it over, and it works for the driver side. Um, how I'm doing the holes? I went out to the car and just took this piece of cardboard with me and marked where the holes are at on the uh, core support, and then I'm just like pretty much lining it up, and I'm going to drill the hole like that. I might just take it out to the car when I go to drill the hole, the mounting holes, and uh, drill the hole like that. I might need to build this part up some, but I was just giving a real quick update on how it's coming. Man, fiberglass shit's hard. I'm not gonna lie to you. Like, I will never do this shit ever again in life. Like, I will never do this shit again. Like, I'll just use the fiberglass uh, filler and do it that way. But laying fiberglass strands and mats, it's messy. I went through, like, a tube of the hardener, liquid hardener. So, yeah, I'm just going to use the fiberglass filler from now on and do it that way. But they don't look too bad, though, do they? And I got some black spray paint. From Walmart, it was like 268 for that. So I'm gonna uh, once I get it all, the holes drilled and everything else done, I'm gonna spray paint it black. Spray, wash them, sand everything down, wash them again, spray paint them black, and run them.